Hi guys, I'm Rachel Brady and I blog and vlog about family, food and home and a whole other load of stuff. Today's video is um, a little challenge that I set to myself because I wanted to stop buying new clothes. So it was something that I thought of myself um, and it's wearing white stuff for a week. Now I didn't manage to do consecutive days because the whole coronavirus thing happened on day six and it distracted me. So it's actually just seven days of wearing white stuff only clothes. So if that sounds interesting to you, then keep watching. Hi guys, yeah, like I said in the little intro there, um, I set myself this challenge because A, White Stuff is one of my favourite shops and I buy a whole load of stuff from there. I didn't realise quite how much White Stuff 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 I owned. Uh, it's a lot and I could actually have done another seven days so I might do part two. Um, I've got a lot of stuff from there. I love it. I love the quirkiness of it. I love the practical nature of the clothes, but that it's also colourful and quite arty and creative uh, seeming, if that makes sense. So um, also, I've, as I've got older, I've just learned that if I buy clothes from one or two shops, um, I find like the, all the clothes seem to go with each other. So it's easy to kind of create that capsule wardrobe type effect. Um, so yeah, without further ado, here are seven outfits, purely head to toe from the white stuff. It is Sunday. I look a bit rough because I've got hardly any makeup on because we're going swimming. And this is the first outfit in my white stuff for a week challenge. This is an old white stuff top. I absolutely love it. I kind of forgot about it. It's actually like a jersey t-shirt. And then this bit here is more like cotton. Uh, well, they're both cotton, but this is more like a gauzy shirt material. I just really like the hippie vibe of it. It's just really comfy. Uh, I got it ages ago, so I doubt it's still available. These trousers, obsessed. They're corduroy, really thin corduroy joggers that are tapered at the end. Can you see? Uh, I absolutely love them. I bought them in sale recently. I am not a size eight. These are a size eight, and they're just about getting away with it because it's elasticated waistband. In the white stuff, I am definitely like a size 10. I've bought 12 before. In most of the shops, I'm a size 12. I've bought 12 before from there and they've been too big. I'm a 12 on top there, though. This is a 12. Yeah, so these are corduroy. They're kind of like grey corduroy joggers. It's very springy outside today, so I think I'll get away with this in a denim jacket. I've got my super gars on that may have been from white stuff, although I'm not going to shoot, include shoes in this challenge but they do stock super guard at white stuff and this bag is white stuff uh it's leather they have this in loads of different colors it was in the sale recently it's got a really nice lining and oh also my earrings today are white stuff so there you go outfit number one of my week in white stuff hi it is monday we're just about to leave for the school run uh, I'm very hot and it's half past eight and um, yeah so day two of wearing white stuff every day that's funny you can hear running around right so I'm going out for lunch I think with my mum today I'm going over to my mum and dad it's her birthday so I'm wearing something way more dressy than what I'd normally wear on a Monday uh, so it's a polo neck under a corduroy kind of pinny these are white stuff earrings uh, I'm going to show you, I've got white stuff tights and I've actually got white stuff boots on. Uh, these white stuff boots are probably still available, this pinny and pearl it might be. I'm going to link to everything below and, and kind of say when it's still available. So yeah, that's today's outfit. I'm going to fit it with the bag that I wore yesterday which is also white stuff. Hello, it is 9 o'clock and I just got back from the school run and it's Tuesday. Absolutely chucking it down outside. I have got a list as long as my arm as my arm today to do of jobs and Stanley's at the childminder. Yeah, kids are at school, so it's just me and Hugo. And it's day three of my white stuff <laughs> marathon. This shirt is so it's one of my favourite things. I wear it all the time. It's got like embroidered little stars on and it's got like a frilly detail, it's colourless, and it's got like a rollback thing, like a like a little button thing that you can do a bit like that so i'm wearing it underneath this white stuff jumper i have worn this jumper to death since i've had it about three years ago i bought it it's just like a really nice thin spring summer jumper 
Uh, again, my white stuff bag, which I'm wearing absolutely loads uh, recently, love it. Uh, this, um, I'm teaming with these jeggings. They're like corduroy jeggings, slightly cropped, not skinny at the ankle. Um, I absolutely love these jeggings. I think they're still available, and I think they have them in different colours. I'll link to them below. I'm wearing this outfit with my silver supergar. And I normally wear these with really low ankle socks because they do look way better <laughs> without socks showing. These are white stuff socks actually. These are men's white stuff trainer socks, which I find do come way above the trainer. But today it's a real cold rainy day and I just thought I can't do no socks or very low trainer socks today because my feet are cold. So yeah, that is today's outfit. Hi, so it is day four of my self-inflicted <laughs> wear only the white stuff for a week challenge. I'm really enjoying it because it's making me really go through my wardrobe and like remember things. Uh, yeah, I wear these dungarees a lot. They're like, I always think of them as like my summery dungarees. They're a bit like tighter and also they have like that ripped kind of uh, frayed ankle which is a little bit more summery. So I'm going to show you my t-shirt print. That's the t-shirt underneath because I'm layered up and um, yeah this is like one of my favourite jumpers. Worn it to death. It's all bobbly but I kind of think jumpers get better when they're really old. This is like a mustardy jumper yeah with my little pur purple t-shirt underneath. This morning I just had a t-shirt underneath my dungas because I was racing around and I'm hot and now I'm a bit chilly. I've just remembered that I'm wearing white stuff pants. Hang on let me show you my pants. <laughs> they're white stuff pants. They are actually white stuff pants. Hi there, it is uh, Thursday and I think it's day five. I'm, I hope I'm not getting these day numbers wrong. <laughs> Problem. Um, of my white stuff challenge and today I am going double denim. So double denim used to be frowned upon but I actually really like it. I saw a picture of Olivia Newton-John yesterday in double denim and she looked so good. Um, and she also had really tousled messy hair so that was my inspiration for today. <laughs> Also, I'm in a rush. Uh, yeah, I don't iron clothes, just to say that to you, but I kind of embrace that. And this shirt <clears throat> is white stuff, obviously. It's got spots on and little kind of swallow motifs. I wear it loads. Um, and today I'm just wearing it with jeans, like I say, double denim. These are skinny jeans and one of my favorite white stuff buys, which is these kind of low to mid heel, slightly cowboyish suede boots. I'm just gonna pop the camera down. Sorry cat, I'm just budging a cat out of the way to put this down to show you properly. So yeah, I kind of have it half tucked in, half not tucked in with my boots. Okay, so I'm going to show you a full length shot. So yeah, it's double denim and I say embrace the double denim. So that's that. I really could do with like a brown leather belt. I have got one somewhere, but uh, today I'm going for a walk with my friend and her son and I'm gonna change the boots, the wellies, and chuck a jumper on, which is also white stuff. I'm just gonna grab the jumper and show you. Hi, so I grabbed the jumper. I am I really like, I like a pop sort of collar, not everybody likes that, but I do like that. And I like a bit of shirt showing at the cuff. I'm gonna come a bit closer so you can see the jumper. It's so nice, it's got like a rib there. It's really lovely and I just think it goes with denim really well and if you're bothered by the double denim thing then it breaks that up. On the website this is shown really smart with like a white crisp white shirt underneath and that's a really nice look too, you could wear that for work. So yeah, that is today's outfit. Hi everybody, I am actually not sure what day it is because I looked back at the footage I collected and I'm just all confused now. Suffice to say, this is so far from consecutive days as it could possibly get. Anyway, I think it's day five, might be day six. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, we are on a coronavirus quarantine like everybody else and I just, I'm spending a lot of time in fleece and leggings and today I just thought, get a grip get back into the white stuff challenge again, go through your clothes and I remembered this top and it's like a lime green triangly, um, what's the material? It's kind of like, oh, I don't know, it's not jersey, it's not linen, it's kind of gauzy, it's kind of like a gauzy material. It feels a bit like organic cotton or something but it's not organic. It's like a natural feeling material anyway. 
it's a loose fit. Let me put that there. <clears throat> it's a loose fit, which I really, really like. It's like a slight V. They definitely don't still sell this because it was ages ago when I got it. And um, I'm just wearing it with my white soft jeans, which are like skinny, but not completely skinny on the ankle, which are quite like, can you see? Um, and I'm wearing it with my silver supercars and I even took the dog for a walk like this normally I put my wires on but I just couldn't be bothered because it's quite dry and that is today's outfit. So I think this is the final outfit but I'm going to have to check. My head's all over the place, we're on coronavirus lockdown and I don't even know what day it is, nearly missed the bins today. And um, yeah, so I think this is the last day. Take two. We have a little assistant. Okay, so yeah, this is just like a throw on dress. Again, it was from a year, a few years ago, so it won't be available now. But what I like about white stuff is they have um, like a lot of classic designs repeated, but in different prints. So there's probably a lot of stuff that's very similar to this. So it's just like a poppy, and I think they're dahlias, are they? Dahlias, I'm not sure. I'm gonna put the camera down so you can see it full length. It's just like a baggy t-shirt dress. <laughs> Let me show you. I've worn, this, I've worn this so much over the years, you would not believe it's got pockets in. I'm wearing it with my leggings that I also wear to death, which are like a navy blue. And I'm wearing it with my supergars, which I did buy from white stuff. Are you sure? I think I bought all my supergars from white stuff. These are so comfy. Like the burgundy supergars. They always have these style pencils in, even if they're not supergar. They white stuff themselves do some, a range of pencils. And yeah, that is my outfit for today because it's so easy. I can chuck a cardi on, a jumper on, a denim jacket on, or a corduroy kind of shearling jacket. It's one of my favourites. So yeah, that is today's pink final outfit of the White Stuff Challenge. <laughs> Guys, I hope you enjoyed that and it wasn't too annoying and distracting that the seven days didn't continue on consecutively. Sorry about that. So yeah, that's all for now, guys. Comment below, do you like white stuff? Do you buy a lot of uh, clothes from white stuff? Where, where do you shop? Where is your favorite shop? I really wanna know where my audience kind of shops and what brands they like and see if I can kind of do content geared around that. So yeah, give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and say hi below. Don't forget to hit subscribe if you aren't already. 